What up guys? Today, we're going to check out this clip that seems to be a bit controversial, I guess? Um, I was just reading some comments, there's like a hundred of them, and nobody can seem to decide on if disconnecting is bad for the game. <laughs> or, no, actually, that's not even what they- they're just justifying the disconnect from this clip. So, let's jump into it, let's see if they have a point, but, uh, I, I doubt it. <laughs> let's see what I'm looking at here. Okay, boost in, pretty cool. They're using corals, uh, they have some sort of missiles. Uh, definitely using a rifle built. Well, okay. So, what I noticed straight away is the... Oh, I can't see. The alpha player, who is the person currently getting absolutely shredded by rifles. He played... He, well, I can't even tell what is... Hold on, let me try to... Let, let's get this the 70... Or, or 720p. It still doesn't... See, even if I zoom in, guys, it, it just looks horrible. Um, I'm trying to see what type of parts he's using because he seems very slow. It doesn't look like he's going... He's Yeah, he's getting shredded by these rifles because he's, in, he's incredibly slow. If you're using missiles, dude, you should be fast. He has soups... Or soaps. I, I'm pretty sure it's a U. <laughs> uh, yeah, see, all, these rifles just shred him so hard. I, I, I have no idea what he's using. He has coral missiles. Oh, two rifles. Oh, um... That's weird, too. He's also not doing any damage to the rifle user. Uh... I really... Honestly, can I be real? This doesn't seem like a... A sweaty disconnect. This seems like a newer player who has no idea what they're in for. And then disconnecting because... They're no longer interested. <laughs> uh, yeah, disconnecting still whack, but I'm saying this is a disconnect from a noob and not a disconnect from a player who's planning on climbing. So, uh, that's yeah. I I still don't think it justifies a disconnect, but if this person doesn't even know people are mad at disconnects, it's kind of hard to uh, absolutely flame this guy. <laughs> On one hand, see, it's like disconnects are bad, right? I don't like disconnects. Um, on the other hand, it's like... This wind isn't really going to solidify your rank. <laughs> like, it's not like you're going to play guys like that all the time. Players are going to be much, much better. And they're going to be much, much more prepared for that rifle build. I have, like, no practice on that rifle build, dude. That thing will probably shred me, too, if I'm too slow. <laughs> I'm not going to disconnect. I, I, I'm already pretty pretty understanding of the reality there. If you're slow against these, this rifle build, it's gonna shred you. Yeah, he's getting like oh my god, he's getting absolutely obliterated. And yeah, so what's, where's the disconnect? Right there. Okay. Um, nah, it... See, okay, now I understand. Now I understand why this is a controversial clip. It's less about... People are looking at the disconnect, and they're like, oh my god, that player's such a garbage person, yada, yada, yada. Or whatever. <laughs> like, it's really just a video game. Who, who honestly cares that much? But, um... I can see where it's like this disconnect. It's like, dude, this person clearly didn't know what they were doing. So it's not... Yeah, it's not really a disconnect from... From a sweat. It's a dis... You know what? Let me, uh... I'm gonna hold off on making, like, a, a decision, I guess, but... It's like, dude, nine times, ten times out of ten, you're beating that build. I, I, <laughs> I really don't know if it's like the disconnect, uh, the saltiest disconnect I've ever seen. You know what I mean? Like, it, it looks like you were beating up on a noob, and uh, frankly, if you're climbing ranked, it's like, dude, it's not really the defining game of your ranked career here. It's just some noob that disconnect. Like, who? Like, whatever, bro. <laughs> like, like I, I gotta be real here. Uh, a little bit, a little bit really. <laughs> if you're beating up on a noob in the DC and you cry about it, bro, you're gonna have a much rougher time when you're in higher ranks, dude. <laughs> There's no way this could be high rank. Oh my god, yeah, like that's not even. I would just re queue and just hope for a better fight, to be honest. Like, I couldn't even. I, dude, to be honest, uh, again, to be honest, <laughs> I couldn't use this clip in a video if I wanted to. 
if I was using, see, if I was a rifle guy, and let's say they don't disconnect, and you just win 12k AP to zero AP every match, I can't use that. I'd be like, dude, <laughs> I wouldn't say thanks for disconnecting. I would still want my points, obviously. And that is, like, you know, um, getting the points is very important, but... Yeah, like, I, uh, I, I couldn't use that fight in a video. All right, l let's see let's see what the discussion is. I can understand both sides here. On one hand, this doesn't seem like that important of a fight. Now, if he was on promotions, that's, yeah, that's another story. That's why disconnects are bad, like, no matter what. But I can understand the controversy, the controversy here because it doesn't look like a good fight. I if it was a good fight and the dude disconnects, yeah, flame him. <laughs> but if it's like this it's 12k AP to zero AP if both rounds were like that dude yeah like I can't, I would disconnect bro <laughs> I would disconnect be like I need a better fight <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna waste four minutes here it, who cares about four minutes but I'm gonna waste time playing against a player who people don't even want to watch me beat up on <laughs> like you know what I mean but however that that's a perspective not many people have so it's it's mostly about the rank points not the clip so point invalidated basically on you know on the side of oh it's a it's a bad fight you need a better fight for a clip that's not really a good point to make here but i just wanted to point it out that i really don't see that uh that i wanted to point out how i view this so when we go into reacting to how other players are talking about it you guys understand my point of view a bit even though it's not very relevant <laughs> all right yep let's go into that don't blame him doesn't look like there was anything he really could have done to that and probably decided it wasn't worth it to try not something i would have done but i get why he did it, it it's a scenario where you get put in with a rock when you played scissors there's nothing you can really do especially against that other auto slot um yeah i just i don't know that's too simple that is, that's true right there's nothing he could have done but like is he queuing up again? Do you think he's queuing up ranked again with that build? <laughs> um, see, that's where it's like, uh, I blame him if he's trying to climb and he uses DCs for that, but I don't know. That's odd. Not something I would have done, but I get why he did it. Yeah, I get why he did it too. It's just I, I get why he did it because he's a noob. He doesn't know what he's doing. I don't know. But yeah, this this doesn't seem like justification to be honest, but it, yeah, it is a little, it, it, it is a little odd. People are just like meh, <laughs> and you know what? Uh, <laughs> nothing scummy about drawing someone who doesn't deserve a win. I'm glad this dude quit on OP to be honest. Okay, now that now that is bad. <laughs> You cannot just start putting it into your hands on who deserves a win or not. <laughs> it appears as though you're actively abusing every design and balance flaw. I wouldn't condone dropping, but I sure as heck ain't going to condemn it in this case. <laughs> what? 29 upvotes, dude. <laughs> it appears as you're, you're actively abusing every design and balance flaw. For my, like, I, I keep having to point this out. For every comment I read here, it's like, dude, this, the build you guys are, like, freaking out over is pretty good. It's, like, top five meta, but it's not the most, like, every design flaw. Yeah, they have tank legs. Yeah, do they? <laughs> they're probably tanky, and if they're using that really, like, bellied up, like, uh, chess piece, or even, maybe even the one I use on my, on my, uh, my heavy legs builds, like, this... I don't know, man. Stability is so insanely disconnected in this game. Like, you can you can eat stagger on tanks and like certain chess pieces, and then if you just go one other chess piece uh, like down or like just just switch the chess piece out, you're going to get staggered in like two seconds. There is some definitely design and balance issues <clears throat> that involve stagger and and like boosting in and stuff. But in the context of the meta and in ranked, the rifle swap build, I'm still pretty sure, is you can just dodge it. And how's a rifle swap build gonna, like, blow up an LCB tank? Well, I guess you could play, like, mid-range it, but uh, it depends if they have missiles. I don't know. I'm, you know what? Like, 
the more I talk about the rifle build, I I, I know like a bait like some basic facts about it or some basic information, but like I haven't really tried it myself, so I can't really say exactly how to deal with it. But I can repeat what I've heard, and to balance when they're switching lasers is pretty good. Or just to dodge anyway. I mean, dude, if you can't dodge anything in Armor Core PvP, it's rough, you know? Um, <laughs> but I've seen tanks dodge things before, so... You can do it, you just have to try, basically. I wouldn't condone dropping, but I sure as heck ain't going to condemn it in this case. Alright, well, whatever. <laughs> You're definitely using some hyperbole with the abusing every design and balance flaw thing, though. It's 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 kind of like a, a really good build. It can definitely dump on some noobs, though. Um, I don't even know if I have a build already that could deal with it. It's just because of how... Well, nah, I, I know. My... My heavy build could likely do some work, but it, if they get close to me, if if they stagger me first, it's it's over. If I stagger them first, I still have to stagger them before they stagger me, I think. Are those rifles stronger than the LCBs? <laughs> uh, probably not. Probably not. Don't play ranked if you're not prepared to deal with the absolute worst this game can throw out. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if that applies here. Quit out BS aside, this build and matchup are a perfect example of the impossibility of trying to balance PvP around Assault Boost in its current form. Oh, wow. This is a good take. Uh, if, I mean, you know what? I need to kick more Assault Boosters, but for now, let's, let's play around with this. If the opponent could reliably maintain distance, it would have made for a more interesting matchup revolving around Jousting. The opponent could rely, but maintained it. it would be yeah, as it's yeah, because they're too slow. I don't know what they're doing. As it stands, when everyone can maintain effortless range regardless of weight, matchups end up revolving around who can match their triggers harder and faster. Yeah. I mean, okay, <laughs> faster, sure, harder. I don't know. <laughs> Long story short, AB needs some kind of cooldown overheat mechanic plus more impactful speed taxing based on weight. Make people work to maintain effective range using their piloting skills instead of giving it to them for free on a single button press. Why is this so good? <laughs> I uh, like I, I'm trying to find something to add here. Um would have made a more interesting matchup revolving around jousting as it stands when everyone can maintain effortless range regardless of weight matchups end up revolving around who can match their triggers hard huh. also ap if everyone is if everyone can adjust their range whenever they want for the most part i mean i don't know how tanks are catching up the rats without missiles i guess uh yeah then then the battle becomes an ap battle or a dps check i guess Long story short, AB needs some sort of cooldown overheat mechanic, plus more impactful speed tax and based on weight. I, uh, I don't know. That's tough. That sounds like a buff for rats, doesn't it? <laughs> make people work to maintain effective range using their piloting skills instead of, yeah. Uh, see, make people work to maintain their effective range. Right. I get that. But then, if you add cooldowns to assault boost, how are people gonna get? How are people going to catch rats? Oh wait, uh, I was gonna say maybe you could lower the ceiling, right? The uh, the maximum uh, the maximum height or whatever. Uh, I don't know. I think they're cooking. I think they're cooking. They're close. They're close. I honestly, I don't know. I would like to see. Assault boosting gets some sort of cooldown, I guess? It really only takes one, though. I don't know. I don't know. You know what, guys? I'm going to leave this where it's at. Uh, if you get to this part, definitely, definitely let me know what you think about this comment specifically. Because this is actually very interesting. This dude's cooking. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh... But either way, guys, I don't really have a strong opinion about this. Definitely don't DC, man. And also, don't go into rank with bad builds. <laughs> and also, we get it. Balance is really bad. So even if you win, who really cares? <laughs> it's, 
<laughs> it's not great. Just play to have fun, man. That's how I've been making so many videos is because 3v3 is matchmaking, super easy. I can bring in a build. I can not absolutely abuse the meta like in duels. Uh, you know, like, th I don't know, 3v3s are absolute, absolutely ridiculous. But a lot of the problems just start to get watered down in 3v3 when everyone is OP and then ev it's... It, there's a little bit more strategy in 3v3s based on picking opponents than there is strategy in any 1v1, man. It is what it is. <laughs> uh, but either way, thanks for watching. Definitely let me know what you think about any of the comments. Uh, definitely want to hear about this one if you guys get to here. This is like this is likely going to be the last comment I show. Um, but yeah, either way, thanks for watching. Armor Core 6 PvP can be frustrating, I guess. <laughs> there isn't really a message here, to be honest. But, yeah. You're not going to catch me getting mad about uh, play playing OP builds when I'm playing ranked. You're going to catch me getting mad about the state of the game. 